Ethiopia, the nation of fairness, the symbol of justice, the origin of mankind. Ethiopia Today is the English language news channel which brings the latest from Ethiopia, mainly focusing on economy and IT digitalization. The Chinese tech giant Huawei is to help ambitious young Ethiopian talent according to Ji Hui, chief financial officer, CFO, of the company in northern African region. Huawei is a leading ICT equipment and solutions provider, dedicated to the development of a broad innovation ecosystem for a fully connected, intelligent world. Speaking exclusively to Chinese news agent, Xinhua, Ji said that Huawei is nurturing Ethiopian tech talent that can add value to the East African country's economy through innovative technology solutions. Ji was speaking on the sidelines of the 6th Global Huawei ICT Competition Ethiopia edition, which annually brings the brightest brains and most innovative ideas from across Ethiopia and the wider globe. The winners among 170,000 student participants from more than 40 countries around the world will have the opportunity to represent their country in the 2022 Huawei ICT Competition Global Finals. The Huawei ICT Young Talent Program is part of the Chinese tech giant's Global Corporate Social Responsibility CSR, activities. This is the third round of competition for Ethiopia. This is the first year we introduced the innovation track, previously we cared more about the knowledge competition, but this year we added more elements of innovation, basically what you can do to add value to the economy and to the ICT industry, Ji told Xinhua. We've previously sent more than 30 students from Ethiopia to China for two-week training programs, to help turn their technological ideas into realities. The global Huawei ICT competition has both practical and innovative tracks. The practical aspect requests a comprehensive theoretical understanding and hands-on practical ability, while the innovative track focuses on innovative technology application and design capabilities, as well as business thinking. The winner will be selected through pure machine scoring and jury scoring prospectively for different tracks. G praised the increasing presence of young Ethiopian women aspirants in Huawei's annual ICT competition. The CFO for Huawei Northern Africa region also disclosed the Chinese tech giant is committed to deepening its involvement in Ethiopia's ICT sector, now that Ethiopia has started to liberalize its telecom sector as the Xinhua report added. The Ethiopian government can help the economy to have more growth momentum besides traditional ways of boosting growth, G said. The Ethiopia Ministry of Finance recent granting of a new license to telecom operators will boost the number of private ICT firms in the East African country which has a large young population and is also a huge marketplace. Ethiopia's telecom industry is considered as a huge untapped market, as the East African country has the second highest number of population in Africa, only surpassed by Nigeria. Ethiopia is also undertaking extensive telecom modernization services with the help of Chinese firms as part of the East African country's aim of realizing digital inclusion and boosting the size of its digital economy with the provision of reliable, high bandwidth and high-speed telecom services. Thanks for your time, and we hope this brought to you something. Please don't forget to give us a like, share and subscribe to our channel. Ethiopia. The nation of fairness, the symbol of justice, the origin of mankind. Ethiopia Today is the English language news channel which brings the latest from Ethiopia, mainly focusing on economy and IT digitalization.